2017 Mount Sac Cross Country Invitational Division Three Sweepstakes. Our individual champion in 1449, Joaquin Martinez de Penils from Cathedral Catholic of San Diego. Course people feel is running pretty fast today. What was your take? You've been on this course before. You know it pretty well. What was your take on the course and how you did today? Well, the weather was great. Yeah. Um, I really liked how we got to run on the road for the last part. Uh, I think it really made us go a little faster. The conditions were great today. Um, I mean, I already got a sense of how fast the course was this year in the first mile. The first mile was really fast. Um, same distance, better course. What I think. Better course because of? I think just like the finish. You see, you see the finish line from such a long distance and just okay. that, that mental cap comes off and it's like, there's the finish. <laughs> All right. Uh, and so as far as you individually on the course itself, did you achieve what you wanted to out there specifically along the hills and so forth? I, you know, I really wanted to push myself mentally, especially right now, um, trying to get my iron levels up. I'm dealing with a little blood problems, but I think I pushed myself a lot. A lot of it was a mental race just because I really was going for time today. Didn't hit quite what I wanted, but I'm really happy that I was able to push myself as hard as I possibly could. And I think with a little more competition with me, just like a bubble, I, I could do a lot better than, say, a state, hopefully nationals, I guess we'll have to see. Joaquin, you mentioned the fact of uh, your iron levels. What, what were they, if you um, mind sharing? For a while, they were uh, a little under 20, Ooh. and I've gotten it up to 38, which is pretty good. But I would love to get it up like 50, that'd be, that'd be awesome. When did you first notice that? How often do you test it? Um, I tested it every once in a while. I really noticed noticed it at uh, Woodbridge. I mean, you get that feeling of just being dead. Like right. you know, your blood, you're like feel like lead. So, right. He's coming, around, you know, coming around pretty well for you guys. I know Finns run really well this yeah. year as well. The group always, you know, Catholic always comes on well at the very end of the season. How are things coming together right now for your squad? Um, you know, whole? we had our first track workout the other day. Jesus. Uh, yeah, we we always start our truck workouts late, and that seems that's always worked with us in the past. I mean, we peaked right at state last year, so we're doing the same thing as we did last year. But uh, we're really excited with how things are going. Team camaraderie is really great now. Everyone's really close. We're running. We're all running really well. Everyone's pushing each other. Finn and I pushing each other. Max Wilson, Todd Sweeney, they're pushing each other. Right now, we're in a position where everyone's just trying to beat each other at that top seven spot, and I think that's really pushing us to be successful. You guys have seen what's out there in Division Three. Obviously, things can change, but from what you've seen and how you guys are coming together, what's the what's the big goal you guys are looking at for the end of the season? You know, we, we really want to go for CIF champs this year, and I would love to get back on the podium at state. You know, it'd be it's going to be a little hard because we lost four of our top seven last year, but you know, in the end, we really want to have high goals for ourselves so we can push each other as much as we possibly can. Well, every year, you guys find a way at the end to do it, put it all together. So hopefully, it pans out again this year. I hope so. Once again, individual Division Three sweepstakes champion Joaquin Martinez Tipinios from Vito Catholic High School. Congratulations. Thank you so much.